Um, next, we have Phil Black. Thank you. For U.S. Congress. I must admit, I'm a country boy, and I will tell you up front, I have this claim. I have an authority on nothing. But what we need to do, we've got to get back to the basics. We started out with the Bible. The Bible was the thing in our country. Every school started with the Bible. That was a reading text. From the Bible came the Constitution. We have turned our backs on both of these. We're in a mess today. We really are. My question is, are you better off today than you were in 2001 when Joe Wilson went to Congress? <laughs> We've got to get back to the basics. I will do that for you. There are four things I will do. I will stay only four years. I will give you term limitation. I will have a salary of $38,000, which is the mean of this district. It will not be 164. There were three years in a row that Joe voted not to give our service people a $1,500 bonus at Christmas time. All three years he voted for an increase in his salary. We've got to go back to the basics. We've got to look at it from the standpoint. We are in Congress to serve the people here in District 2. I will stay with the health program I have. I will stay with the retirement program I have. And also, there will be a sign on the office. <laughs> Lobbyist, not allowed. We have 13,000 in Washington. They spend over $50 million a year. That's a lot of hot dogs and hamburgers for our politicians. This sign right here will get Joe more money than he got when he said you lie. All the pack, um, country, uh, I said companies, will start pouring money into Joe's campaign. I'm not looking here for money. What I want from y'all is the most precious thing you got is your vote. If you will give me your vote, I will stay four years. I will change it. I have a dirty dozen hit list of things that need to be downsized or abolished. One thing we need to start with is the Department of Education. EPA. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's so many things we need to look at. Not Thomas Jefferson said it best. Government is at its best when it is governed at its least. I got one more minute. Oh, I can go for another minute then. <laughs> but anyway, I'm a business person. <laughs> 37 years I've had a business in Barnwell. Okay? Last year was the first year in 37 years we didn't show a profit. I worked 26 years at SBA. What I did was help small business. We look at what's happening. I was on the school board of Lexington 1, voted 6 to 1, 6 to 1. I did not want to put that beautiful administrative business office that we have downtown. We had 10 extra acres in White Knoll. We could have built on it, paid $3,500 an acre. We paid $5,500 an acre to where this um, building is now. We've had to buy three additional buildings to make up for the space that we needed. Very inconsistent, very unprofessional, very unbusinesslike. So what we're looking at is consolidation. I talked with the sheriff a couple months ago. I said, you know, we need to look at consolidation of the Department of Law Enforcement. We don't need city, county. We need one law enforcement in the county. Consolidation. That's it. Like I said, if you will let me go to Washington, six reasons I want to go, six grandchildren. I am devoted to our young people. Thank you. <laughs>